An outer space spectacular that was the stuff of dreams only a generation ago began snapping into the sharp focus of reality today after its billion mile journey from Earth the Voyager 1 spacecraft sent back pictures of man's closest look yet at the ring planet Saturn. The closest encounter of spacecraft and planet occurs later tonight when Voyager sails just 77,000 miles from Saturn's yellow clouds. But already one scientist said, in the strange world of Saturn's rings, the bizarre has become commonplace. David Dow reports. Just before closest approach, Voyager 1 could at last look up at Saturn's famous rings. And the maze reveal there prompted one scientist to speculate that Saturn may have as many as 500 rings. One photo released today shows that Saturn's outer ring is actually a tangle of two rings. A late color photo of Saturn's cloudy surface shows distinct wind and weather patterns. But some of Saturn's moons continued to provide the biggest surprises. A crater 80 miles across on Mimas. A canyon 500 miles long on Tethys and broad fields of apparent frost on Rhea and on Dione, both moons about 600 miles in diameter. Today, Voyager even shot a picture of a recently discovered moon, just 80 miles in diameter. The data flowed in so fast with so many surprises that only days may reveal its meaning. You, your, your, your idea as to what we'll see is as good as mine. My own impression is it's going to be a really a very exciting 12-hour uh, period coming up. It's the unthinkable that we're looking for. Voyager 1 will continue transmitting to Earth for years as it disappears into the outer reaches of the solar system. Meanwhile, U.S. planetary missions such as Voyager are winding down to a handful, their future clouded by budget problems. When Voyager was designed, U.S. ambitions and expectations in space were boundless. A reminder of those days is aboard Voyager as it continues into the universe. A recording of United Nations Secretary General Kurt Waldheim greeting any life Voyager might encounter. I send greetings on behalf of the people of our planet. We step out of our solar system into the universe seeking only peace and friendship. David Dow, CBS News, Pasadena, California. The copper-plated record mounted on Voyager's side contains the sounds of Earth, including greetings from President Carter, the sound of a kiss, and classical rock and folk music. A sister ship, Voyager 2, already is on the way for a scheduled visit to Saturn next August, and it may go on to the planet Uranus in 1986 and Neptune three years later.